Yo, I'm Lizard Chase. Welcome back to my playthrough of God of War Ragnarok for PlayStation 5. Please like and subscribe. You can also click the bell to get notified when I post new videos. Also, I live stream over on Twitch. The link will be in the description down below. Thank you guys for all the support. Let's do this. All right, guys. Uh, we're going to go back home, continue the main quest line of the day. Uh, I figured we'd do that before we do any more side stuff. Um, I'm really feeling the main quest line right now. It's got a lot of momentum. Uh, now that Atreus and Kratos are finally back together as father and son. So let's get to it. Well, also, it's kind of forcing us to, to do that. Do you want now. to take care of anything before going back to Sindri's? No. First, we retrieve Mamir. Ah, yes, we need Mamir. Then you can tell us what you learned in Asgard. After that, we shall see. You really do think of him as a brother. What about Freya? Hmm. Seems like she moved in while I was away. Once she turned her hatred back to Odin, she recognized our interests were aligned. Yes. Huh. I tried convincing her of that, but... When was that? Oh, before I started telling you where I was that night. I see. Mm -hmm. Hey, she didn't kill me. I said nothing. Hey. We're coming clean now. Clean slate. They're going to be better. Oh, hi. You're looking for the boss man here. Yeah. So sorry. He's off cleaning up all the damage Garm did. Ah. Uh. Back soon, yeah? <laughs> Jerk. All right, better. Don't have to be like that, man. Uh, Finner's not here, so I guess Finner's at home home? In Midgard? They're back. How did it go? The beast should trouble us no further. Well, that's a bloody relief. So you put down old Garm, did you? Yeah. Sort of. Atreus, your decision to go to Asgard after all he's put us through. I'll never understand it. Mm. But I hope you at least came back with something we can use. I hope so too. Atreus needs to apologize to Sindri. Let me show you what Here's what he cares about most. More than Ragnarok or anything. Is this mask. Anyone recognize it? That thing? Ugh. Oh, it's a dead end. He's been faffing around with that since before I knew him. To be honest, I thought the giants were just having a laugh with that one. Atreus needs to apologize to Sindri. Okay, fine. No. You're wrong, Mimir. This mask is no fraud. The giants didn't make it, and only a few of them ever glimpsed it in their visions. Like Atreus? They never knew its origin, but some believed it was a way to gaze into the secrets of creation itself. Is it an oracle? Much, much more. Oh... Imagine becoming one with a source of infinite knowledge. This? This is why Odin tortured me. So what do you think? Know it? No. It's one obsession he never saw fit to share with me. Mm -hmm. But I'll tell you this. Even when Odin speaks the truth, his purpose is false. Either way, it's a mistake to let it distract us. Is Heimdall our focus or not? We will rewrite our fate another way. Then I'm going back to Vanaheim. If we're not taking the fight to Odin, I should help my brother stand against him. Go help Freya. Join her when we can. Father, I'm going to study my notes on the mask. See if I can think of a plan. But if you want to go anywhere, I'm with you. And listen, everyone. 
I'm really sorry about the way I left. You know I've never hurt any of you on purpose. Well, when you can turn into a bear by accident, I suppose these things can happen. So, do you forgive me? Of course, Atreus. We know you meant no harm, lad. Sandre? I'm sure I will. Eventually. Okay. Guess I'll take it. While we're clearing the air, I hope that I can be forgiven for not doing more when the Hellwalkers attacked. Whatever reservations I have about violence, they shouldn't apply when your home is under attack. And certainly not Reed. by undead abominations. Yet I reached for a shield instead of a sword. You were right to chide me for that, old friend. The next time the moment calls me, I'll be ready. Okay, good. Well said, Tiara. I believe you just might. Let me upgrade our axe for you. But you have to stand to see it looking like that. This will be of use. You are well. Take more than a port full of bone John <laughs> stiffs to keep me down. Good. What am I gonna do? Walk around with a bandage on my head, begging for attention? I was uh -oh. mauled by a bear. Nudged, more like it. All right, Leviathan next. We can upgrade it. Uh, can't upgrade that. I don't have enough purified bone. Uh, let's see here. Chaos blades. Uh, that's lacking as well. Spear. Waste on. Can upgrade the waste. It does have more strength and defense. Damn! Am I good or what? So we'll go ahead and equip that. Okay, this is all good. Uh, let's head on out. Hey, wait. We're with you. Okay. Uh, I've decided we're going to go help Freya. To Vanaheim. We travel to Vanaheim. Great. You gonna check in on Freya? Yes. Glad I get to come this time. Ah, oh, yeah, this is Atreus' first time to Vanaheim. So, what happened the last time you were in Vanaheim? I still don't know how you got Freya to stop trying to kill you. We traveled to her village to break Odin's spell. Once freed, she accepted that I was not her enemy. You also missed a highly entertaining moment where Brock was lifted ass over face in Freyr's camp. You met Freyr? What's he like? Different from his sister. Lacks her conviction. True. Mm -hmm. He's a bit quicker to forgive. And an ineffective leader. But his heart's in the right place. You'll like him, lad. Beautiful. And, uh, what? It is also dangerous. More dangerous than hell? What's this thing? Some kind of altar? I do not know. Yeah, we still don't, uh, haven't solved the mystery on that one yet. Freya's camp is to the right. No rush, is that? Not every day the lad gets to see a new realm. To Freya's camp, then. Time to see how the Vanir have fared in our absence. I hope Freya's okay. She can care for herself. We're still checking on her, though? Her brother's forces are outnumbered, and there is much I owe her. Ah, I see.
Nice. Hey, that's the other half of the broken moose behind seed we found. We can take it to a Mystic Gateway. Maybe we'll find Sutter's combat trials. <laughs> Yay, more combat trials. I'll do those later. No one here. That's not good. Stay alert. I don't like this, brother. I don't see any dead bodies, so that's a plus. Hi. Kratos. Atreus. A welcome reunion. Unexpected, but welcome. You know us? Can't be. Is that who I think? Oh, you shifty bastard. It's almost good to see you again. And for once in the shape of a man. Or nearly. So that's how they got your head out of your ass. Maybe now you'll stop being such a half-blind, piss-drunk, oversexed liar. He was more of a pig than I ever was. I do not know you. Do you not recognize your handiwork? <gasps> Hildas Vini! Remember when we first met Frey in the woods? After I... Shot him. Oh. I am so, so sorry about that. Freya's boar. Freya's boar. Her advisor. And friend. Counselor to the Vanir. And yes, while exiled at Midgard, I was trapped in my boar form. And then you shot me. At my command. No. My arrow, my mistake. Forgotten. Vanaheim needs our help more than ever. Even Mimir's. Come. Just watch where you aim that bow of yours. <laughs> my hide's not so thick in this form. Jokes. We can head out whenever you're ready. Where are we going? I have a favor to ask. I'll explain on the way. Okie dokie. Hilda Svini. When we first met Freya as the Witch of the Woods, we had wounded her magical boar and helped her heal him. Now we have met him restored to his human form. A trusted counselor to Freya and Freyr, he appears to hold no grudge against Atreus and I, but his rivalry with Mimir seems long and bitter. Where is Freya? She came here to help her brother. She leads the search party for Freyr and Bigvir. They've been captured by the Ainher Yard. Not good. Right, that happened. An ambush. The presence has intensified since your last visit. To make matters worse, the Celestial Wolves haven't been seen in days. Or at least I assume. Not easy, tracking time with no moon in the sky. No moon. No moon. Just like in their shrine. Their shrine? It's a long story. You want us to check on them? You have my gratitude. We're spread thin. And if anyone can help Skoll and Hati, he'd be a fellow giant. Very well. Freya mentioned you had a way past this. You don't disappoint. Continue down this path and you'll find their dead. Good luck. Yeah, but I wanted to look around. Okay, we're good. And don't shoot any more. You think he's really forgiven me for shooting him? Trust me, lad. The old swine still carried a grudge. You'd know it. What happened between you two? The usual. Miscommunication, conflicting loyalties, broken promises. <laughs> Nothing to concern yourself with. I'm not concerned. Just curious. Curiosity's all well and good. <laughs> but so is privacy. Huh? Okay, okay. <laughs> More taken. 
Do to do to do. Feels nice being back as uh, Kratos and Atreus. Oh, this place. looks and feels so different from the other realms. It's warm, like Svartalfheim, but there's a kind of thickness in the air. Hmm. Egros. Uh, what? Egros. Greek. For humid. Mm. Egros. I like it. Alright, here we go. Back this way. By a knocking, perhaps. Doubtful. Awesome, we can get to that chest now. Going for more loot, huh? I saw a forge back at Freyr's camp. Has Brock been helping them out this whole time? Ah, you haven't met Lunda yet. No, he hasn't. An old contemporary of the Hulder brothers. She serves as Freyr's blacksmith, keeping his team armed and outfit. Heavy runic attack? Powerful axe throw. There are turns with devastating impact. Kratos is fully protected while shielding. That does a lot of stun. Oh, another legendary blacksmith? I bet she has some good stories. Take caution, Atreus. What? Why? She is quite friendly. <laughs> oh, nonsense. The lad's far too young for her taste. Uh, <laughs> what? Don't worry about it. I think we can get through here. You know, lad, 
This excursion into Vanaheim means you've now visited each of the Nine Realms. Huh. Guess you're right. Not many mortals can claim such a feat. Not many gods either. Even your father has yet to grace the halls of Asgard. I'm in no hurry to do so. Hell, does Vini said Freyr and Bigvir were captured? Who's Bigvir? He's a light elf. A former scholar exiled from Alfheim with his wife, Bela. <laughs> he may be their best warrior. Why was he exiled? You'll have to ask him for the full tale. But I take it that he and Bela's quest to unite their people was frowned upon. Wait, Bela's a dark elf? Yes. Wow. Well, that raises even more questions. I hope he's okay. Where's it at? I hear Raven, but I do not. So there. I need to go that way, but first. Two Asgard ingots, yes. Okay, it seems okay. I was just testing something out. Testing, testing, testing. told us Ragnarok begins when Skull and Hati catch the sun and moon, right? I said it was foretold, lad. Prophecy. Which, after our time with the Norns, we've all had quite <laughs> enough of. But Odin still believes. That's <laughs> why the angry are stole the moon. He's still trying to avoid Ragnarok. Or he prepares for it. Fights a proxy war in this realm to distract yeah. his enemy. Or that, I guess. That's the noise.
That just looks so cool with the spear. Ah, oh, like a Spartan. I can sense them up there. It's got to be their den. Excited to meet Skull and Hati, lad. I mean, I've heard all your stories. It's going to be weird meeting them in person. Legend meeting reality. At the very least, it shouldn't fail to entertain. Look at them. Uh, hello? I think they're sleeping. Well, there you have it. The legendary celestial wolves. Supremely entertaining, as promised. Remember their shrine? They didn't rejoin the sky until after the moon returned. And then chased an arrow across the sky. Right. Well, best we go find the moon and put it back where it belongs, eh? As if that's a perfectly normal thing to say. No. Look how beautiful this looks too. Oh, good puppers. We'll we'll be back, guys. We'll be back. The Aner Yar played a part according to Skull and Hati Shrine. Managed to stuff the moon inside a box, if memory serves. But it didn't say where they took the box. Aye, that's the rub of using prophecy as a map, isn't it? A bit sparse on the details. There's a war camp in the nearby village. A strong fortress to guard their bounty. We will try there first. But so besides Hildas Vini and the elves, who else is part of Freyr's army? Not my <laughs> army, really. Although Beer Girl was a soldier, once walking the path of a traveler. I imagine he's handy with that enormous broken sword of his. A traveler that doesn't want to kill us. That's nice. <laughs> Time to open up. Did you see that? I didn't know they could do that. A new enemy. Stay alert. Yeah? Correct. Hmm. Fitting. Heard at the vanner knowledge of the abundance of their realm. But the need to write it down is redundant. The beauty of Anaheim speaks for itself. Hmm. Guess they know we're coming. I can't believe no one's here. They hide. The Vanier aren't all hardened warriors like our dear Freya. Those who survive the warfare find it easier to hide in the jungle and use nature as their shield. I heard a raven. I heard a raven. I heard it. I heard the sucker. I hear him, but I can't see him. <laughs> hear him. I can't see him. I want to throw my spear at him. This 
wall. When I bring it down, we strike. Yep. Yeah, it's gotta be on the other side. Uh empty. Where'd they all go? This feels like a trap. Wait, there's the moon. Uh box? Down there. That's gotta be it. This is definitely an ambush. Yes. We can get to it from up here. Oh. Look out. Called it. Hoping that puts a dent in Odin's forces, mm. at least for the time being. I don't think Asgard's running out of soldiers anytime soon. <laughs> Ready to put the moon back where it belongs? Okay. Yes. Yeah. That is a weird thing to say. It is. <laughs> <laughs> from over here. Yep, I got it.
attacked me. Hold on, I thought I... <gasps> that raven's mocking me. Ah, there it is. Nice, another raven sent ah. to see the dead. Perhaps we should check up on it. Hmm? Ten left. There! <laughs> Waterfall. He's still up there. Another ambush? Really? Third time's the charm. They are not smart. I and there's that. <laughs> you know, what we're doing right now? All of this? It's almost exactly how we saw it play out back in Skull and Hati Shrine. The wolves are back in Vanaheim. We're rescuing the moon. Yes. I remember the prophecy. So, doesn't it make you worried? If everything we're doing now happened in the Yotnar Shrine? Remember our agreement. Prophecy will not dictate our actions. Yeah. Our allies need help. That is our focus now. Brother, we've taken a wrong turn. Our thief's gone skyward. Yes, we went the wrong way. I understand, Mamir. Thank you for pointing that out. Almost to grab this while I freed Garm. Ah, uh, that's why he was there. there. I, I didn't know. And now you fight to undo the damage. Your guilt is misplaced. Yeah. No, you, you're right. We can return to the den through here. They will pursue. Keep your guard up. Father. How are you so sure we even have a choice about what we're doing? Doubt is a weakness we cannot afford. Who said anything about doubt? So far, we've done everything the giant said we would. We make our own choices. Nothing forces us. Hey, there you are! On the left! <laughs> That's right. But what if, by doing all this, what if we're walking straight into Ragnarok? Isn't there any way to avoid faith? Your faith? What if we can't stop you from... Would you turn your back on the wolves? On this realm? 
Remember our agreement. Okay, there's nothing back here. Not sure this is the right way back to the den, brother. Also, I want to check. Uh, I've got a, a points to spend, uh, and the Leviathan Max can be upgraded. Extend pride, extend pride of the frost with additional pressing of R two R two. And uh, I think I'm gonna hold off for the time being with the axe, and we've got all that upgraded as well. But what I do want to do is uh, go to my Leviathan axe. That's fully upgraded. Can't upgrade that any further. I'm going to hold off on that. That's fully upgraded. Actually, we'll do that just because it's quicker and I don't have to worry about enemies being stunned. Um, okay, we're good. I just had to level some stuff up. All right. Time to see the puppers. Good old Skull and Hottie. The lad does make some good points, though. As long as Atreus lives, so be it. So be it. Nothing. You want your ball boy? Like inside their shrine. Yep. If I do this, fate only binds you if you let it. Do what is necessary, not because it is written. Good choice, lad. They have a gift for us. Way to call them anytime we need them. Really? Day night cycle. Hmm, I like it. Remember that altar we saw when we first got here? I think that's where we're supposed to use it. <laughs> Perhaps Freya will know. So in essence, they just gave us the keys of dusk till dawn. Not bad for a day's work. No, not Should bad at all. And tell him about all this. Yeah? Yes. Back to the cap. Look out! Yep, still 
very, very egros. Liking it less now. Right, nothing else up here. We're good. Got that already. That wasn't the same one from earlier, was it? No. They come back fast. Not that fast. In Asgard, what else did you see of Odin's army? Well, all these Anheryar we've been fighting, they've already died in battle once. We kill them here, and they'll just wake back up in Valhalla. They never truly die. Ah. They come to war. We do well to have our own endless army of dead soldiers. Mm. You mean Helheim's army? Yeah. Like the prophecy said. It will not come to that. Crocodile hunter, oh, Ooh, man. Guess they like the egros. Artillery of the ancients. Hmm. Okay. All right. Uh, I don't see any other loot around. So we can get out of here. We can get across from. So we report back to Hilda Sfini. Then what? We came here to help Freya. We will not leave without rescuing her brother and the Light Elf. Okay, but Odin's not going to stop searching for mask pieces. That is his concern, not ours. Sure. But if that mask offers all the answers. Then it will surely exact a price. Be wary of shortcuts to knowledge. Yes, father. <laughs> Do 
all the plants who want to kill us? No, no. <laughs> Only the carnaptious ones. Ah, that wrinkly mug belongs to Helka. She's a blossinder. Hounds prized for their pinpoint accurate tracking abilities. You'll love her. Okay, uh... Okay, before we go in there and, uh... Continue... Uh, let's see here. The video's already running... Yeah. Yeah, it's almost... It's getting close to an hour. So I think this is where I'm going to uh, stop, save for the day. Um, we'll continue on next time. Thank you guys for watching. We got, we met Skull and Hottie and uh, returned the moon to the sky. That was an awesome scene. Really cool. Glad to have Atreus and uh, Kratos back together again. Father and son time, you know? Uh, but anyways, guys, that's going to be it for the day. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure you leave it a like. If you haven't yet, please make sure you're subscribed. It helps me out a whole lot. Um, and... Also, turn on notifications so you get notified when my new vi next video comes out. Um, it should honestly be tomorrow. Uh, thanks, guys. I appreciate y'all, and I'll see you guys in the next one.